Hey everybody, Kuzmos here, back with another Minecraft Bingo. We are doing the second of the weekly Blind Bingo Challenge Seeds for the week of June 19th, 2015. The seed on the right is 4802. Uh, this looks like a fairly interesting card. I'm seeing two lines, maybe three, that look pretty reliable. The two that most pop out to me are the far left row and the fourth, I'm sorry, the far left column and the fourth row down. I'm thinking, honestly, the fourth row down is our best bet. While it does require both redstone and gold, we're going to have to get down low anyways, uh, because the far left column also requires the redstone, and I think We've got a pretty decent chance to find both redstone and gold, and we'll need an iron pick anyways. Otherwise, that far left column does take quite a bit of iron. Now, however, the second row down, if we can come across pumpkins, might actually be better. But pumpkins are... Where am I going? Pumpkins are very iffy prospect. They're, you know, you can get lucky, stumble across them, so we will keep that in mind. Uh, we'll actually try to keep an eye out from up here, get this into position while we're coming down. And if we spot any pumpkins, we'll probably change tactics, go that route. Well, not enough lo is loaded in at this point. And it is another night vision week. Hopefully I still have that on there. Yes, we do. We'll, of course, have to reapply it once the game starts. I should really turn off clouds. That would make it drastically easier to spot things from the skybox. But pumpkins should stand out fairly well. Alright, we're going to go this route because I see cows right off the bat. And we will need sand, flint, a little bit of extra wood. And that about will cover it, aside from going down. So we've got our sand there right off the bat. Plenty of cows, and there's a bit of gravel. Let's take the corner off, head to the top. Again, I really have no reason that I do it this way, but... It just... I don't know, feels better to, to me. Uh, it might just come from having to take down, having had to take so many trees down when I've died in the night, and it kind of protects me for the first little bit. So, uh, it could entirely just be that. Is that enough wood? And what? Let's get. Okay. We'll get more wood after we have tools. It will... well, that's not effective. It will go a little bit more smoothly that way. And you know what? We're going to use a bit of this for a wooden sword. So we're going to go ahead and get our pick. That's not how you make a pick. And we'll get our furnace stone. And then kill some cows, and then get the remaining little bit. It's not munch, but it might save a little bit of time. We'll just grab this cow, honestly. This, sh Well, you know what? If he wasn't a jerk and running away... Uh, wow, really? Apple right there. I'm going to grab it just in case. But this should hopefully at least be enough to get us going. Alright, so there's our shovel, our axe, and our sword. Make certain this is... Alright, that cooked all the way. That's good. Okay, let's go ahead and get everything out of the way. And get everything in its proper position. Alright. So we've got that. 
we've got our furnace. Now, let's grab that apple just in case. And get ourselves a little bit more wood, because I really don't feel that nine wood is quite enough. Wow. Okay, that is just ridiculous. I think I might need that. It's not like it was much time wasted to whack a quick mushroom. Alright, now, let's kill ourselves some cows. And, uh... Take a quick look, see what we're doing again. Going down, what wood we need? Ah, uh, yes, okay. So I need to get back to that gravel. And hopefully, it will quickly... That is not effective. Hopefully it will quickly give me flint. It did not. But, alright, let's go ahead and turn our night vision on. Oh, this sounds promising. Alright, I see a creeper down that way. Alright, there's our flint. And let us see... Alright, that's... Oh, goodness! There's a lot of stuff around. Just keep hitting them. Alright, a spider came from somewhere. Where did he come from? Alright. Oh, goodness, there's creepers everywhere. Yeah, see? Creepers everywhere. Alright, so we went this way. Now let's see if we can recover our position and our stuff. It's right over there. It should not be hard. Let's not let this get us set back. Um, I suppose, hey, on the plus side, let's turn this back on real quick. As long as we don't have too much issue recovering our things, this will reset our hunger. So, you know, look on the bright side, I suppose. More cows there. Okay, this zombie is going to be problematic. Just keep him back. Things are, of course, going to be out of order, and I'm going to teleport as soon as I pick up my maps. Alright, we use the shovel to hit him. There's our axe. Okay, sword, pickaxe. This shovel goes here. Cards go there. Okay, so, back on track. Except I don't have my food on me. Uh, let's eat what we've cooked. And I really should have paid attention to how much iron I actually need. That's the one thing I always forget to check. Alright, let's go ahead and get our furnace down. Uh, we'll cook with that. That's fine. I've kind of did the math and figured out that I believe it's only it's slightly more beneficial if you're able to use all of what you've dug up to use coal over uh, wood. However, you're not likely to do that very often. All right, there's another. Which one am I doing again? Okay, sign. Sign, I can do the sign. Let's do that real quick. All right. Let's go ahead and... What other iron things do I need? I just need the compass, which that will be enough for, and I will need the redstone. So what we'll want is to use what we've got to make a pick, actually. So I should have done that before breaking this down. Alright. A bit of a crowded inventory. And we will need... We have all the iron we need. Okay. So we need to get down quick. Was that him? I feel like there should have been more. What level are we on? 41. Okay, let's move this to the proper position. Oh, this makes me a little bit nervous. Okay, we're getting close to something. It was off to my left, I think. Alright, yeah, there's... Okay, there's a spawner. That 
could be quite promising. Let's see where we come in at it. Aside from the obvious, the corner. Alright, not much spawned yet. Let's drop in here. Alright, break this quickly. There's a redstone. There's a bit more iron. And we'll take the bread. Alright, let's go ahead and make our... Oh, let's put this down. Um, wood, any kind of wood. Trees, sure, whatever. Okay, we need the first one of these. And then after that, we don't care, actually. Alright, let's get some more food cooking. During the bit of time that I'm making... Take that out, goodness. Alright, I think I can do this, just... I have to keep myself from getting nervous and a little bit flustered. That's enough. I really need to keep that there. Alright, just just in case. Alright, sadly that was a completely standalone spawner though. That's kind of surprising that I managed to get close enough and hear that. Alright, we don't need iron. All we need now is gold. Oh, goodness! Oh, am I gonna... I'm not certain if I can make it. I'm not healing. Okay, so... What can we do? What can we do? What can we do? Think about this. We've died twice. We need to get down, back down that hole. So we need... We need a pick? Is that a good idea? I... I'm not entirely sure. Okay, I actually, I don't know why I'm digging this. My stuff did not burn. But it might. Did I even need... I don't know. Let's go ahead and get a bit of wood. Okay, one more piece and we should be good to go. And man, if I hadn't gone down right in that same spot, we would have been fine. Now we put wood down, so there's actually a pretty decent chance. Okay, let's go ahead and make this into what we need. I do want to get tacked up to at least a stone pick. I should probably also make a sword, I think. That seems advisable. That's not how we do that. Definitely not a hoe. Alright. Things back into position. Uh, this goes over here. Okay, so. We have a... Oh, uh, goodness, of course we have a creeper right there. That's how these things work. Alright, so we need to... Oh, boy. I can't afford to have him hanging around. Just a little bit too dangerous. And unfortunately, I'm going to have to... redig my path. Okay, let's drop that last bit. Whoop! Okay. Nothing's burned yet. That's promising. Hopefully we get down in time. And... Alright. Stack up just a bit. Let's sort things out just a little bit. You know what that'll do? Um, food, food, food. Any food will do. Alright. So, there was lava. Was it over here? I don't know which side the lava actually was on. I'm hoping the lava... Is, okay, that's where the lava is. Put that down here, and we will... Well, there's the redstone that I actually don't need now. That really just seems like 
an underground lava pocket without anything else. Yeah, I'm definitely still over it, it would seem. Let's just take a look. There's redstone. That's not really what we need. Uh, dirt seems semi-promising. Let's get our shovel. Um, we don't... We just need gold, right? Um... Okay, I couldn't resist grabbing the diamonds. Is there any other alternatives that diamonds opened up to us? We could make a diamond hoe that... that yeah, that rose right out. Um... Honestly, digging down doesn't seem a good prospect. Because, well, really, so many bloody diamonds, I would love some gold, please. Honestly, I'd love a cave, actually.
and welcome back guys we've uh finally broken into a cave that well we finally broken into a cave period really that hopefully will pay off for us i'll be honest i was about another 20 blocks and i was about ready to just jump into the next lava i found not that i was finding that much lava to be honest Ooh, a potato let's eat that Oh, finally, gold. Don't you dare blow it up. Or kill me. That's also fairly important to me. Um, yeah, let's dig this up. With our lovely diamond pickaxe. Um. Oh, poor bat. This. How much gold that I even need. Okay, let's go ahead and get this down. For a moment I was worried I didn't have any sticks. And there we go. 31 minutes. I'm sorry. Yeah, 31 minutes and 30 seconds. That was perhaps one of the longest stretches I've had without a single cave. Of course now there's gold and caves everywhere. And even a spawner. Let's go hit them and look in their chests. Well I suppose they're skeletons. You can always look in their chests. A lot of iron, lovely, redstone. Alright. That, uh, will do it for this run. I wonder what will happen here. Interesting. Alright, to be honest, that was a pretty abysmal run, guys. Uh, I hope you enjoyed, and I, well, I hope what the presumably sped up digging sequence is uh, not too terribly boring. But, until next time, guys, catch you later.